So let's just apply that to one word problem and then we are all done for today. So the word problem says a submarine is situated 800 meters below sea level. A submarine is 800 meters below sea level. If it ascends, that means go up. If it, go up to, if it goes up 250 meters, what is its new position? If it goes up 250 meters, what is its new position? Not the most difficult problem on the face of the planet, but here's the key. You have to use our learning from today, okay? Write an expression using addition of integers to solve this. Okay, so if a submarine is below sea level, do you think we're going to assign a positive or negative quantity to that? Okay, negative. I would agree with you. So we're at negative 800. That's how deep it is. And it ascends 250 meters, so it goes up. So would that be a positive or negative quantity? I would say positive. So really we're adding a positive 250, okay? So this is what they mean when they say write an expression using addition. So I've used addition of integers, and this entire fra math phrase here is called an expression. When you're just adding a couple things together without an equal sign yet, we call that an expression. All right, and that's, that's what I want. This is how you show your work in, in this unit. This is how you're going to show your work on your final assessment as well. So now we're in a position where we can complete this. What is negative 800 plus 250? Well, if I subtract these quantities and find their difference, all right, let's think through that. That's going to be 550, okay? And then is it going to be negative or positive? Is my answer going to be negative or positive? I hope you said negative because this is, has a larger absolute value and 800 is negative. And then we'll give it some units, meters, below sea level, okay? So that's how we're going to apply our learning to word problems. So good luck, good luck working on your classwork and homework. Bye-bye.